Only on two tonight, a retired teacher says she's been getting sick from living with mold in her southwest side apartment for months. She says multiple complaints to management have been ignored, but once KPRC 2's Devin Clark showed up at the leasing office today, she may finally get the help she needs. The story is all new for you tonight at 10. I'm fed up. In November, it will be two years since Barbara Lauderdale moved into her ground floor apartment at the Falls of Chelsea Lane. She says she's been dealing with issues ever since. I can't take a bath or anything, you know, a wash, whatever, you know, I can't because why is it turning off the hot water? She tells us there have been multiple times she was left completely dry. They would turn in the cold, the water period off for a while and I think it was just a way of saving money because they would turn it off at least three times a more a week. She also believes leakage from her patio is allowing moisture to seep in her home, causing mold to grow and make her asthma flare and skin itch. See all this white stuff that's growing? It's growing out of the not only is Lauderdale concerned about possibilities of white mold, she says she's convinced that this is black mold because it started out as a small spot on the ceiling at the beginning of the year and since then has grown to what you see there. She says she's told management about it for months and no one has done a thing. So we visited the leasing office. Despite the log of complaint emails to management that Lauderdale showed us, staff members who didn't want to go on camera told us about plumbing repairs that may have affected the water, but say they were unaware of any mold issues. They're telling a the lie. They heard about every issue. Now, after speaking with us, they're vowing to get rid of the mold within two days. But Lauderdale says it's too late. I've been waiting for them to make repairs and this and that. So now I'm in the process of moving. Oh, yeah. But I don't know where. On the southwest side, Devin Clark, KPRC 2 News. Okay, so any tenants experiencing mold or ongoing utility issues at their complex are advised to call 311 and the Houston Health Department to report that. Make sure you keep a record of all of your calls. You can also get free legal help, and we have all of that information for you on our website. Click to Houston.com.